The bullpup is always ready to go, and the packaging means you can get an awfully long barrel in a very short gun. A bullpup rifle or shotgun encourages proper form, too, because there's only one real way to set up and shoot. As always, there are pros and cons. The best bullpup rifles and shotguns tend to be a little back heavy and muzzle rise is part of the package. So you'll have to change your technique to bear down on your target a little more. They're also heavier and switching out mags takes a second longer. Clearly, this isn't a deal breaker. Bullpups have become more popular for game hunting, defense duties, and generally messing around with shotguns. In order to assist you in making an informed decision, we've compiled a list of the top six bullpup shotguns, along with their key features and important factors to consider when choosing the ideal one for your needs. For a more comprehensive analysis and a convenient comparison tool, visit our website, gunsyoucantlivewithout.com. Here, you'll find in-depth information to help you select the perfect bullpup shotgun for you. Number six, UTAS UTS-15. The UTS looks very similar to the Caltech KSG, and it's also a pump action. The bullpup shotgun is quite different. In particular, its twin tubular magazines sit atop the barrel instead of below. Though, the gun went through comparable growing pains to its American counterpart. Feed issues and jams were the order of the day when the UTS-15 hit the scene around a decade ago. A redesign later, UTAS has ironed out most of the bugs. Similar to the KSG, if there are problems, it's generally due to improper slide manipulation. You've got to work on it. As to the unique design, there is a method in the madness. It lowers the bore axis. In turn, the shotgun's recoil impulse is directed back into the shoulder, reducing muzzle rise and making the 12 gauge more pleasurable to shoot. It also improves the accuracy potential particularly shot to shot. The UTS-15 certainly doesn't want for firepower, holding 14 plus one shells, but given its complex feeding system, it can't be easily located on the fly. Number five, Keltec KS-7. The wee little KS-7 is a descendant from the KSG and simplifies the design rather nicely. This single tube gun holds seven rounds and presents a very affordable bullpup blaster. The KS-7 is super lightweight and shorter than a Mossberg shockwave. Yet you get a stock, seven rounds, and a weird but efficient mounting system for accessories. Bullpup shotguns are rarely this simple, but the KS-7 is a nice break from more complicated guns. Simply load the tube, rack the pump, and you're set. The controls are ambidextrous, and ejection is done through the bottom of the gun, ensuring both righties and lefties get their day in the sun. Bullpup shotguns, much like bullpup rifles, are often slow and awkward to reload. That is an issue here with the loading port in front of your armpit. It's slow to reload and awkward to reload while on target. However, the little 5.9 pound shotgun handles well and is so damn short, it's easy to use in a phone booth. One of the significant pros of this shotgun is its extreme lightweight design, making it easy to carry and handle. Additionally, its compact and extremely short size further adds to its portability and ease of use. With the capacity to hold seven rounds, it ensures adequate ammunition for various situations. Lastly, its downright affordability makes it a popular choice among users who seek a cost-effective yet reliable option. On the other hand, there are a few cons to consider. One downside is that it can be awkward to reload, which may be inconvenient for some users. Furthermore, it lacks stock optics options, which may limit its customization potential and hinder those who prefer to have additional sighting aids for improved accuracy. Number four, IWI Tavor TS-12. The largest standard capacity in its class and ability to deliver overwhelmingly superior firepower in a semi-auto package, the IWI Tavor TS-12 is a beast of a bullpup. IWI is behind some of the best and battle-proven bullpups on the market. Its take on a shotgun is just as impressive and well-built. Featuring three tubes that rotate with a twist of the hand, the TS-12 packs a full 15 shells in the tubes, plus another in the chamber. And again, multiple tubes 
give you the option to get crazy with your loading. Semi-auto via a gas operated system makes this a fast shooting bullpup that takes minimal effort to operate. The controls are modded after the Tavor line of rifles and are not too different from AR-15 controls. The main thing to train and get used to is twisting the shell tubes after one runs dry. 1913 rail on top for optics, M-lock down the side of the forend for weapon lights, slings, and more. You even get some QD sling mounts in the buttstock. Two downsides we've found with the TS-12. First, it seems to have a break-in period. The first 200 to 500 rounds or so, it can be a little picky on what ammo cycles well. I recommend a range session or two, running a lot of buckshot to get things to work in a little before switching to low power stuff. Secondly, the TS-12 is not super left-hand friendly. Out of the box, a normal TS-12 will eject from the right side and likely slap lefty shooters in the face with shells. IWI does offer the TS-12 in a native left side eject, but finding one is difficult, to say the least. You can also have IWI convert your right side eject model to a left side, but this requires sending it into IWI for service and paying for it. The TS-12 cannot be converted by anyone except IWI. They won't even sell the parts to do it, even if you wanted to DIY. Number 3. Rock Island Armory VRBP-100 Rock Island Armory is well known for affordable 1911 style pistols, but they've been experimenting with shotguns that look like AR-15s too. That being said, check out their bullpup, the VRBP-100. For a change, this 12 gauge is a semi-auto bullpup with a stout, durable build and has one of the best prices you can find on the market. It really shoots and can take a beating. The Rock Island AR style design aside, the VRBP-100 has an adjustable stock, non-reciprocating charging handle with a rubber cap, accepts mobile chokes, and has a dust cover. The charging handle isn't reversible, but it's pretty intuitive. You only get five rounds, but it takes 2.75 inch shells, not just three inch ones. If you can find nine or 19 round detachable box magazines, you're in the clear. The reloading is slow and the mag well takes a bit until you get used to it. The VRBP-100 has a lot of things, but it sure isn't tactical with its 20 inch barrel. At least you get extra capacity and muzzle rise mitigation with it. So you can't say that it acts as a competition shooter. Number two. Panzer BP-12 G2. The Panzer BP-12 G2 bullpup shotgun is manufactured in Turkey. It is the Gen 2 version of the original BP-12. Some of the changes from the original include a sleeker profile for reduced weight, a threaded barrel to allow for chokes, and an updated gas system. All of these improvements make the BP-12 one of the best bullpup shotguns for value for the money. The Panzer BP-12 delivers all the flexibility and performance you need in a tactical shotgun. The BP-12 G2 handles three inch Magnum shells and even does pretty well with lighter loads. Another thing I appreciate about this shotgun is that it is loaded with Picatinny rails. This gives you lots of customization options and room for all your favorite accessories. As a result, it's one of the most versatile bullpup shotguns you can buy. A sling can be used which is a nice feature to have on a tactical shotgun. The safety is ambidextrous, so it accommodates left-handed shooters. However, due to the lack of a rear deflector, the cartridges can sometimes fly back. That is not ideal for lefties. The BP-12 has an AR-style bolt release, mag release, and grip. The barrel is chrome-lined and 20 inches long. However, the overall length of the shotgun is just 30.7 inches. It also features an adjustable cheek riser that helps ensure a comfortable fit when shouldering the weapon. The shotgun is well balanced, compact, and easy to point, making it ideal for tactical scenarios. Overall, the BP-12 is the perfect bullpup shotgun for home defense. Furthermore, it's also a blast to shoot out at the range. Number one, standard manufacturing DP-12. The standard manufacturing DP-12 is a bullpup pump action shotgun chambered for three inch shells with essentially two guns linked to one central brain. You don't fire both barrels at once, but you do load once and fire twice with these bullpup shotguns. Is that worth the additional weight and complexity? Probably not, but it's fun. 
Now this is home defense, bear defense, and just about everything else. If you need more than this, you have a real problem. Also, you might want to upgrade your ear protection. Providing 16 rounds on tap, Dandard says the DP-12 was, quote, designed for the most discerning shooters who demand extreme firepower and require consistent reliability, end quote. In conclusion, we hope our list of the best bullpup shotguns has been helpful to you. If you found this video useful, we would greatly appreciate a thumbs up. Please let us know in the comments section below which bullpup shotgun you plan to choose. Thanks for watching. If this video has been beneficial in any way, don't hesitate to give it a like. To stay updated on future videos, be sure to subscribe to our channel.